which characters are you from? I am Kirito from Sword Art Online Alpine Season 2. And I am Asuna from Sword Art Online Alpine Season 2. You look amazing. So what inspired you to do this kind of cosplay? It was just a spur of the moment. We just decided that we wanted to do something awesome and Sword Art Online is big and up and coming and so I was just like, hey, why not do Sword Art Online? And I'm like, it deserves its props. It's a really cool anime. So what about you? Well, we watched the anime and she asked me to be her partner for Sword Art Online and I said, sure, why not? You look so cute together. <laughs> So what took you to make these cosplays? Oh, it took a very long time. A lot of wood cutting, a lot of pricking fingers, bleeding, sewing for months and months, using her as my model, all that kind of stuff. It took a lot of time and a lot of work. What did I do? I pretty much helped her with stuff like I didn't do any of the sewing or anything. I did a lot of modeling and a lot of pinning. You work well together to come out with these amazing cosplays, you know that? So, please let us know, uh, know uh, which uh, character are you from? I'm from the Mass Effect series. I am Femme Shepard, the female version of Commander Shepard. You look amazing. So, what uh, what inspired you to then, uh, do this cosplay? Uh, after playing the Mass Effect series, it was just uh, it just blew me away, and it's changed my life in such a positive way that I just I got so attached to the character that I couldn't not cosplay it. <laughs> That is wonderful. Thank you, Anna. Thank you for telling us that. Thank you so, much. so, and so, what what took you to make this cosplay? Um, it took me about four months. Uh, I think if I were to do it again, it wouldn't take me much time at all, seeing as how I'm already familiar now with the materials and all the tools required to make it. Can you tell us now which uh, now character are you from? Uh, I am Mega Man X from Mega Man X. Uh, game started in 1985, so. That is awesome. So, what inspired you to do this cosplay? Um, well, Mega Man X was my favorite game of all time, and I played it probably non-stop for probably ages 5 through 12. So, um, so obviously, favorite character had to do the cosplay. How do you feel being the hero of your... Well, I mean, it, it's pretty cool um, being... Uh, the person that I've always wanted to be, and uh, it's interesting, definitely. Um, something that I've uh, aspired to be for quite a while, so thank you. That is amazing. So what took you to make this cosplay? Um, it took 43 things of hot glue, it took uh, 27 sheets of foam, and a lot of time, probably about two weeks worth of work. Wow. Oh, and uh, some reflective film and Christmas lights. So. That is amazing. So, can you tell us uh, which character you are from? I'm uh, Nicholas D. Wolfwood from Trigun. And I am Shizuo Hiojima from Durarara. You guys look amazing. So, what inspired you to do this cosplay? Um, well, Trigun is one of the original animes that I watched growing up. And ever since, I mean, I was probably like 10 when I watched it, and I knew right then that Wolfwood was one of my dream cosplays. And I just recently, I mean, I made this entire cross uh, by myself. I mean, I had his help, but I mean, it's it's the, one of the biggest props I first made, and I'm just, I'm really proud of this cosplay. It, it's really brought my childhood back. And you and have Kroniko? Yep, I've got Neko-sama. That's amazing. So what about you? Uh, well, I mean, I watched Durara, and it's probably one of my favorite animes. I love the style, I love the genre, and I just saw this guy, and I'm like, you know, I connected to him, because he's a peace-loving guy, he doesn't like violence or anything like that, but he, he does have a darker side. But, uh, you know, I just really love the character, and I, I, I thought it would be a lot of fun to carry around a big, ripped-up sign, and, uh, you know, I've been loving it ever since. Well, that is nice. So, what what took you know, what took you to make these cosplay? Uh, well, I mean, the suit itself, I actually scounged from thrift stores or out of my closet, the bow tie, such and such. The prop took about you know anywhere from seven to eight hours to make. Uh, painted the sign myself. The base of it is made out of styrofoam and liquid concrete. Of course, you know, just PVC pipe painted. Me and her both worked on it, and we I think we did, it came out really well. 
And yeah, same, like this whole suit, I mean, it's just pieces from thrift store, the shoes. I did I did end up making the crosses for the sides and just the glasses and the way I, I added a rosary for like, for, you know, propage. And this whole cross is made out of a installation foam. It's, a, it's like six layers and then just painted with craft foam. So it probably took like a, about a week to make. So super proud. You did an amazing job. Yeah, we'll